Today's makeup look is to bring my face alive for when I'm not wearing white, because I suit white more than ecru cream, but I love this jumpsuit, so I want to try and make it work. There's a little bit of shimmer there, which helps in some pearl. So I'm kind of taking on that, and I'm gonna go for some hope, our new Mother Earth, and a little bit of fortune, and mix that up. So I'll start off just with the hope on my eye. It's a little hint to the color in the braiding of this jumpsuit. And then I'm gonna go in with a little bit of fortune tune just to bring the sort of more beautiful burnished copper warmth that I can see in the jumpsuit there. Then I was sort of inspired to think would I go actually also for some desire and just smoke it up a bit. I'll take a little tea kit. God my desire is really running out. One of my favorite shades. And I'm just gonna smoke it there across the edges of my lash line like that. Chucking it on now. I know I'm gonna come in with some under eyes, so I'm not being too careful. Just thinking I do need a stronger eye. I'm really not being careful at all, am I? You're looking thinking, is she kidding? But then I'm just gonna blend because our products are so blendable. I'm gonna blend back in and I'm gonna blend above like that. I've got that depth of tone that I want not even clean it up under my eye, just sort of give the full color wowzer. Then I'm gonna go back in with a bit of hope and put it on that inner corner like that. Then I'm gonna get a new tea kit because I want to do what I do with sun, with hope, which I haven't done yet, so I'm quite excited, which means just going into the inner part and then bring it out on my lower lash line. I like that actually, it's very nice with hope. I usually do this with sun or star. The trick is to put it on the end of your tea kit. I've got it on either side at the moment, which will give a thicker line. Bring it quite away under there, because I might play with it still blending into my desire at a later stage. Now, as we will all agree, that's terribly mucky, but I'm gonna clean it up. Let me just blend a bit up here, just to show you how Easy this is, blending it all out there, blend a bit more out there. And then I'll get my favorite parody trick. So I'm gonna take a little bit of Mary, put it under my eyes there. Oh, I love that hope in there. You can hardly see it because it's covered with everything else. I'm gonna do on the outer corner, actually a little bit of Izzy, because I need it quite thick to cover my huge mistakes. But it's gonna be all right, girls and boys. Clean fingers, tap back and forth. Get the shape you want under your eye, just like that. This is when all those YouTubers use sellotape to kind of give themselves that clean eye. I'm just going finger. You see? You didn't think it would get that clean, did you? Pretty, pretty eye. Definitely today need lashings and mascara. Let's do lashings and you can just see that hope in the corner of the eye, which I'm loving. And do the bottom of my eyelashes too but you just see the hope poking out. And then I'm thinking, I was going to go schmuggy when I did Desire on my lip and cheek like that, which does work. But I also wanted the warmth of Lila. So I'm gonna do both. So I'm gonna start with schmuggy just to give depth. Shove it there. And then I'm gonna get Lila because I like Lila and Fortune so much together. Oh, I've never done schmuggy and Lila. And I love that. And then I'll put it on the cheeks because we want to feel glowing and well. There we have it. How to make a sort of off-white work for you. So this is Ecru. My makeup is sort of warmer, which is more in keeping of warmer skin, hair and eye combinations. So because I sort of sit in neutral, I've taken the beautiful Lila, which is warmer, Desire, and of course, our gorgeous new Hope. There we go. Look how pretty that is. I can tiny bit more just divine. Makes your eyes go, hi. That's what we like. Anyway, make up the day.